Hello again, my name is Mike Varell, Wyoming Beat Reporter for the Casper Star Tribune. Today we focus on the tight ends. And it's a lot different tight end position than it was a year ago when Dave Christensen didn't use the tight end very much. Uh, you rarely saw a tight end. None of them had big time production at Wyoming. Not going to be the case this year. You've got two tight end sets. You know, they'll be run blocking, they'll be out catching passes. It's a lot different than the pro-style offense of Brent Vegan and Craig Bull. The question is, does Wyoming have tight ends who can fill that role? Well, first on the depth chart coming out of the spring is senior J.D. Krill. He came here last year out of junior college. There was a lot of hype out about him before this season. Ended up not having a single catch all year. He had some drop issues. We'll see if he can make strides as a senior. At the very least, he's a big, strong guy. He will help them in run blocking. Number two, you've got Jacob Hollister, another junior college guy. An interesting story for him, he was a uh, high school quarterback in Oregon. He won player of the year in Oregon as a senior, but he transitioned into this uh, tight end role. Really athletic kid, but we haven't seen much from him. We'll see what he can show us in the fall. Number three is a converted wide receiver, Eric Nzacha. Another guy who you might look at him and say, he doesn't look like a tight end. He's not a, too big of a guy, not a ton of bulk, but that's what the coaches like about him. They want him to be a speed tight end who can sort of be a mismatch against linebackers, uh, be a, a more of a pass catcher. Then after that, you've got the Cavalry coming in. you got three freshmen coming in, Brinkley Jolly, Tyree Mayfield, and Grant Lewis. All three of those guys are going to have to come in and compete in fall camp. The coaching staff has said that if one of those three freshmen is the best tight end on the field, that guy is going to play. There's no guarantee to J.D. Krill or Nzacha or Hollister that those guys are going to be the first in line. The best player will play. It'll be an interesting uh, competition to see in fall camp to see how those tight ends are used and who pulls ahead in that competition. Uh, tomorrow we uh, go to the offensive line, but until then, my name is Mike Farrell. Take care.